various basic principles essential to violin playing. I have spoken of the three-dimensional continuity in which we work, of the need for stretching, for flexibility, for balance, and of the command of the space around us. I have tried to evolve exercises which would imprint these principles upon our muscles, our body, our habits, so that subsequently when we speak of the violin technique, we will be able to apply these principles to the smallest details of that technique. But it would be a mistake to assume that these principles are restricted to the technical and the physical, because these very same conceptions apply equally well to the mind and the heart, for we speak of stretching the mind, of maintaining the balance of our thoughts and of our feelings, so that we may be subtly reacting to the smallest influences around us. We must remember that we live in this three-dimensional continuum and that our minds and our hearts operate in the same way as our bodies do.